Hello, I'm Mark Seward and I'm the Communications and Internal Affairs Officer. Now this year we've had a lot of ideas submitted to our democratic forums and some of them have proved to be quite controversial and have gone to referenda as a result. Now you get to decide whether they become policy or not. Of the eight ideas going to referenda, you'll get to decide whether or not Leeds University Union should oppose sexual objectification, if the university refectory should have meat-free Mondays, and whether or not the university should oppose the display and promotion of unpaid internships. This week, we've been speaking to students on campus to find out how they're going to vote in May's referendum. Um, I think they're a really good idea. I understand that um, some people don't want that forced on them, but um, I gave up meat for six weeks during Lent and I found it really good um, and it's completely private. No, um, I think it's a waste of time to be honest. I think if it's people's choice and you shouldn't force an opinion on them. And if they want to eat meat then they should be free to do so. No, I don't think they should. Um, I'm not going to go into Essentials and buy FHM for myself, but I think it's up to people to make the choice for themselves. We think, yeah, that they should oppose it. Yeah, because it's a university, it's an equal place, they shouldn't be promoting sexual objectification. But at the same time, we understand it's people's choice if they want to buy like a lad's mag or something. Uh, yes, I believe they should. I believe that uh, when students go into employment, they need to get a fair, a fair deal. Uh, the university hasn't in the past supported students when they've been on unpaid internships and have been more worried about pleasing employers than helping their own students. So I mean, this is a step in the right direction. Um, no, uh, I think that it's up to the student um, what internships they take. If they see that a job is unpaid, it's their decision whether to go for it or not. I think it will uh, limit the amount of opportunities other students have. I'm going to say no, um, because I think that it's impractical for two reasons. Um, mainly that fact that it's going to be really hard to keep on top of, um, who's going to monitor it, and who's going to keep track of it. Um, the other thing is that it's actually quite impractical for students as well, um, in terms of whether it's on the way to a lecture, say if you're in a hurry or whatever, and you really want to say, right, you wait, you wait, you want one. Um, and it's going to take time every day to go, go and find a smoking area. Um, I think yes, because secondhand smoking is quite unpleasant, and the cigarette butts as well would lead to, the lead to already like, a lot of litter, I think that will help combat uh, the problem in a minute. So voting opens on Monday the 14th of May and it closes on Thursday the 17th of May at 4pm. You can vote by logging in via the portal or via the union website. It's really important you use your vote to ensure that your city, your union and your university is better for everyone.